I'm meteorologist Carl Bonag. Welcome to Upper Michigan Source Weather on Demand for the last day of 2013 and the first day of the new year. Officially the high temperature on Tuesday, the 31st, one above the low 10 below, put it all together, 19 and a half degrees below the long term average. This turns out to be one of the coldest December in years. In fact, going well back into the uh, 1980s before we see a, a December as cold as this one will turn out to be. And it's certainly been snowy in the Copper Country in Keweenaw County through uh, December, 122 inches. That was through the 30th. There was more snow during the day on the 31st. For the season, 151. Last year, at the same time, only 42 inches. What a difference a year makes. And as far as the cold, look at Canada now and Alaska. Virtually everyone, except for the far southwest in British Columbia, below zero. Many spots well below. In fact, in the Northwest Territories, many areas got to 50 below and even colder. And we've got on the southern perimeter of the Arctic air some snow down in the southern Great Lakes, Milwaukee, Chicago, maybe eventually Detroit. This should turn into quite a snowmaker through the Ohio Valley and then up into portions of southern and central New England. But for us, Arctic high pressure will dominate on Wednesday with snow showers near Lake Superior and that uh, wave of low pressure will head off to the east. This high will move to the east and then the next high pressure area will dominate on Thursday. That means a day similar to what we expect on Wednesday. Snow showers near Lake Superior, still cold, but not that much wind. Then for Friday, the highs start to move off to the southeast. Winds will start to crank up out of the south and that means, well, temperatures will rise, but it won't feel warm. We could have some light snow, especially over the northern UP. This low will head to the north of us, drag a cold front through on Saturday, and then more bitter cold air starts to roll in to end the upcoming weekend. As far as snow goes on Wednesday, it looks like the uh, heaviest snows will likely concentrate in Alger County, maybe into far eastern Marquette County as the winds start to veer more northerly with the approach of that high pressure system. Your TV six day forecast. Again, temperatures will gradually moderate uh, with the wind on Friday. Then on Saturday, before the cold front, highs will likely move into the 20s over most areas, and it'll turn quite a bit colder again late in the weekend.